So I just edited down this new three minute rock paint tutorial. The original is over 36 minutes. Of course, I'll link to it in the description, but we're gonna do a heart mandala. So start with a template so you have a nice symmetrical heart. We're gonna create a curve along the bottom. Now take your time on this curve because everything's gonna be building off of that. Now when you create curves, if you don't like how it lands or it seems a little off, you can thicken your line. This is a great hack for fixing your curve. Now when you start making your designs, you will love this little trick. You want to break your curve in half, then in quarters, then fill in in between. As you build out, it will help keep everything lined up. Now, once you get further away to make good arch, give yourself a place you're planning to land so that when you're making that curve, you can follow as parallel to the previous curve as possible, but you also have that eyeball of where you're trying to land. This will really help you out. The next thing you want to keep in mind when making your designs is you want all your lines to head towards the point of your heart. So you'll see that I am constantly turning my stone so that my lines are going towards the point. Again, in this section, we split in half, then in quarters, and then each of those sections in half again so that you end up with nice, even sections. From this point out, it's all about letting your creativity flourish. You can do so many different designs and patterns working your way out of your stone. Remember to give yourself grace on the first few that you do. Some of your lines to you might start to seem a little bit off. Like here, I want this point slightly to the side. Uh, just kind of fill it in how it looks good to you. You can make a lot of corrections when you're coloring in your design later. Now, as you get even further from the point of your heart, you might wanna add a third dot in the center. Just kind of see the distance from the tips of the last thing you've done. Give yourself kind of a dot along the middle. This will help you like we did before, kind of connect the dots as you create your curve. Now, doing mandalas in a heart is a lot easier than trying to do a full circle mandala, especially if you're a beginner, because you're really only doing about a quarter of a design. And as you get out into the top of the heart, you have a little bit of forgiveness because you can use a little creative license to finish up your design however you want. Now I do a lot of dots and things within my design because as you'll see at the end here when it's colored in, it's a great way to add little pops of color all the way up. So I'm just gonna wrap up this design quickly here in this last 10 or 15 seconds. I'll show it to you all colored in. Of course, this is a full length tutorial on the channel as well. There's a card in the corner and in the description below where you can get um, even more tips and tricks and watch me do it in real time. I hope you enjoyed this three minute tutorial. If you did, leave me a comment below letting me know you wanna see more of these. Don't forget to subscribe and we'll be back soon. Bye-bye.